Hello and good morning, Ma'am Janelle. This is the reporting of House of Samson. This reporting is about national artists. I'm going to report the name of the national artist, Manuel Conde. Manuel Conde was a Filipino actor, writing, and director, and producer. He was taking up geological engineering and entering the movies was farthest from his mind. It was a bit player, stuntman, laboratory, and veterologist, a puppet named Kiko. As an actor, he also used the screen name Juan Urbano during the 1930s, aside from his more popular screen name. He was born October 15, 1915, and he died August 11, 1985. His wife's name is Elvera Reyes. His child name is John Urbano. He is awarded National Artist of the Philippines. His movie created Genghis Khan, Si Juan Tamad, and Ibong Adorna, and more. Manuel Conde created some of Philippine cinema's greatest masterpiece, including Juan Tamad, Ibong Adarna, and Genghis Khan. So now, we are going to know more about his history. Through the more than 40 films he created from 1940 to 1963, Manuel Conde contributed in no small measure to the indigenized of the cinema, especially by assigning it a history and culture of its own by revitalizing folk culture with urgent issues, fresh dance and new techniques by decepting and critiquing. Also, Manuel Conde to be named National Artist of the Philippines. It is an open secret, otherwise I will not know about it, that Manuel Conde will be named Photos Mostly as National Artist for Cinema by Philippine President Gloria Arroyo on June 11. Manuel Conde, born, born on Manuel... Urbano, 1915 to 1985, was the first director from the Philippines who was invited to an international film festival. His groundbreaking Genghis Khan, a trump of visual imagination over small budget, was shown in 1950 at the Venice Film Festival. His most popular films were the satirical films, on Juan Tamad, a, a oblong type of gesture from Filipino folklore, the lampoon, the Philippine society of his time. Unfortunately, these, like many of these other films, are lost and those that still exist in bad shape. A recently published, lavishly illustrated, and meticulously research book by film scholar Nick Tiongson and designer Cesare Hernando brought the actor, director, and producer back into the limelight. As a kind of early independent film marketer, he produced some of his best films all by himself. However, unlike most of the digital independent film makers of today, he managed to combine critical acclaim with popular success. He directed comedies, war movies, and historical and fantastic films, including a Filipino version of the Germanic Siegfried myth. His last year were spent hunting for treasures. From what remains of his films, it is clear that he was a major visual talent who would be considered among Asia. Finest directors of the 1950s, if only his works were better known internationally, 
other national artists for film in the Philippines are Gary De Leon, Lino Broca, Ishmael Bernal, Fernando Poe Jr., and Eddie Romero. More on him on the website of Manila-based video store, Video 48, The Secret Film Archive of the Philippines. Abdul Mari, Asian Emo, born January 14, 1936, in Siasis, Sulu, Philippines, Commonwealth, dead December 16, 2014, wake at the Lo Loyala Memorial Park, Marikina, Main Chapel, dead, Im dead Emo on 16 December 2014 at the age of 78 at his home in Marikina. A native of Sulu, Abdul Mari, Asian Emo, is a sculpture painter, photographer, ceramics, documentary, filmmaker, cultural researcher, writer, and articulator of Philippine mus Muslim art and culture. Abdul Mari, Asian Emo, born January 14, 1936, in Siasis, Sulu, Philippines, Commonwealth, dead December 16, 2014, wake at the Lord. Loyala Memorial Park, Marikina, Main Chapel, dead, Im dead Imo on 16 December 2014 at the age of 78 at his home in Marikina. A native of Sulu, Abdul Mari, Asian Imo, is a sculpture painter, photographer, ceramics, documentary, filmmaker, cultural researcher, writer, and articulator of Philippine mus Muslim art and culture. Dr. Abdul Mari, Asian emo, beloved brother, father, and grandfather, a creative soul of the Bangsamoro National Artist of the Philippines, faithful, join Allah in the early morning of December 16, 2014. It was Dr. Ima wished to accept a state funeral upon his demise as well as to hold a week to allow family member and friends to pay their last respect and say goodbye. Dr. Ima married to his friends and colleagues a full feed and colorful life as an artist coming from very humble beginning he worked his way to school and survived scholarship to chase his dream of being an artist he adopted the medical sari manok of maranao legend is his painting and culture has a visual metaphor of the depth and richness of his native Mindanao, particular the Sulu Archipelago. He studied at the College of Fine Arts, University of the Philippines, where he was mentored by fellow national artist Guermo Talentino and Napoleon. He received a smidge and Fulbright Scholarship for Graduate Studies at the Kansanas University in the USA. He also received two-year-long fellowship at the Rhode Island School of Design and Columbia University. In New York, he was the he was the first of a Museum of Modern Art, MOA, Fellowship Grant of Study in Europe. Upon his return in the Philippines, he took fine arts at the University of the East. He always 
did several photojournalistic and scholarly research work about the people of Mindanao he studied and promoted indigenous broadcasting technique and several corrupted ser several public art and historical installation around the country. Dr. Iwal is a true academic scholar and faith taker. He is a mus Muslim artist but he is also a Filipino. Creative who style and expression but across culture and religious limits. Dr. Imal described himself not just a religious but as a spiritual his faith is reflected the exuberance of the pattern and colors of this artwork that celebrate life without borders. Osama Seda, born January 31, in 1917 in Manila, dead May 5, 2004 in Quezon City. He dead on May 5, 2004 at the age of 87. Instrument Piano Awards Cuban Fellowship of Humanities Latin America and Guardian. Education University of California, 1961 to 1963. Cell Cortot, 1937 to 1941. Jose Maceda was a Filipino ethnomusicologist and composer. He was named a national artist of the Philippine of Music in 1998. Rosada graduated with a music diploma at the Academy, Acad, Academy of Music of Manila in 1935 before he was sent to Paris, France where he studied piano. His composition like Ugma Ugma in 1963, Pagsamba in 1968 and Udlot Udlot in 1975 are monuments to his unflagging commitments to Philippine music. His other major work include Agug Agugan Agugan, Kubing, Pagsamba, Ugnayan, Ading, Aroding, Siasid, Suling Suling. Musicology at Columbia University at Anthropology at Northwestern University and Ethnomusicology at the University of Columbia, Maceda embarked on a lifelong decision to the understanding and population of Filipino traditional traditional music. He he had done research resulting in the collection of an best number of recorded music taken from the remotest mountain village and farthest island communication. He also visited many places in the Philippines, Sarawak, Thailand, Kalimantan, Africa, and Brazil. He wrote paper that included Filipino and foreigner scholars about the nature of Philippines' traditional and ethnic music. His experimentation also free Filipino musical expression for, from a strictly, strictly unique conic mold. He 
usually performed as a communal ritual is composition like Ugma Ugma in 1963, Pagsamba 1968, and Udlot Udlot 1975 are monuments to his unplugging communication commitment to Philippine music. His other major works include Agog Agungan Kubing Pagsamba Ugnayan Adding Aroding Sia Siasid Suling Suling Maceda was Professor em, em, Emeritus at the University of the Philippines UP and a specialist in both Indonesian and Filipino music piano and ethnomusicology at the UP College of Music from 1952 to 1990.